Hi, this is Matt. This week we are focusing on fish and wine pairing. Fish, as you all know, is a pretty delicate beast and I think the main thing when it comes to pairing fish and wine is we don't want to overpower the delicate flavours of the fish. Also, there's a lot of richness in a lot of fishes um, and you all put some lemon juice onto a fish and the whole reason we do that is to cut through the richness and cleanse the palate. So we want wines which are going to have that same citrus effect. The first thing that we're going to look at is shellfish. So shellfish like we've got some lovely scallops here but also think about lobsters, prawns, crab have lots of richness, lots of fattiness and we really want a wine which is going to maximise that zingy lemon effect. The wine that I've picked is a Blanc de Blanc Champagne. So Champagne is a sparkling wine produced in the north of France. And Champagne has some of the highest levels of acidity in all wines. And Blanc de Blanc, which is pure Chardonnay, pure white grapes, has the highest acidity of all. As well as the acidity, as well as the lemons, it also has a rich, creamy, almost shellfishy character, which is gonna work wonderfully with any scallops, with any lobster, or with any creamy crab dishes. So Blanc de Blanc Champagne is a fantastic choice, or you could have any non-vintage champagne or sparkling wine based on, on Pinot Noir and Chardonnay would work well. Oily fish, so here we've got some mackerel, and then we've got some smoked fish. Smoked fish doesn't really work with champagne. The reason for that is for some reason it gives you a slightly metallic uh, flavor in the mouth. So I want something with very high acidity, but something also with a bit of the oaky smoky character as well. So the wine that I've gone for here is quite unusual. It's a it's a white Bordeaux. So this, is, this is a blend of Sauvignon Blanc, which you all know from Marlborough, blended in with a bit of Semillon, which gives it more weight, more richness. And this is a oaked wine and the oak vanilla and spice is going to work really well with the oaky smoky character of the fish. Finally, firm fish. Firm fish really it could be a red wine dish, it could be a white wine dish, depending on what sauce you're going to put with it. If you're going to have cod in parsley sauce, buttery, light, creamy, a white wine is going to be best. So here we've got a Chablis. Chablis is from north central France, made from Chardonnay. Really clean, apple flavours, citrus flavours, which are going to work really nicely against that cream and parsley sauce. Alternatively, we could be putting this fish in a, in a red wine sauce or cooking it like they do in Spain. So this is a nice bit of cod and cod with chorizo and paprika and red peppers is a really common dish. And in those instances, you can put red wine with these dishes. So a red wine like this, which is a Gamay from Beaujolais in France, really light, really soft, really juicy. It can work really well with richer, more full bodied fish dishes. So shellfish. You want a really rich, creamy wine with a distinct citrus edge. A Blanc de Blanc Champagne is perfect. Smoked and oily fish, you need high acidity and you need something which is going to cope with that oaky smoke character. So this oaked Sauvignon Blanc from Bordeaux is beautiful. Then with firm fish, depending on the sauce, if you're having a white wine or a buttery sauce, a Chablis is going to be perfect. If you're going to have a red wine or a chorizo sauce, then a very delicate soft gamay is the best choice. Still confused? Download the app using the link below for your iPhone or Android device.